Hi, I'm Lucy Pedigo, and we're at Del Norte Bakery in Dallas, Texas. And I'm going to show you how to prep milk and ice a uh, tres leches cake. The mixture of the tres leches is um, condensed milk, regular milk, and evaporated milk. And you just soak it all the way, make sure it gets a good soak. The tres leches is a very popular Mexican cake. And we started doing it a few years ago, and it is our best seller here at the bakery. You can put any kind of filling in it as well, flavors. And this is just the vanilla cake. And I will prep it with um, the dulce de leche. Normally, we let it soak for about a good 20, 30 minutes to make sure it goes all the way in. And then when we're about to ice it, you just grab your board, flip it over, and then we soak a little bit more on top as well. I would say it's, um, depends on how people like it. Some people don't like it too, too wet, too soaked. Some people do. They want to make sure they taste the leche. Um, it usually kind of runs off a little bit anyway as we're icing it and prepping it. And so I would say it's kind of all, they're all even mixtures with the milk and the condensed milk just to give it a good amount of flavor where it's not too sweet and it's also not too reduced. So then to ice it, we can do one with uh, the dulce de leche. We usually, you can use it as a filling or of course you can cover it. If you do the filling, you either fill it now or, or slice it in half and then do the rest. So first you just kind of put the filling on top. Sometimes we can put, we make like a little dam with icing around the back, around the bottom. But uh, usually because it is milky, I mean, that kind of does come with the territory. So what you would, you would do is you would just do this, the, the icing for the middle, and then just kind of let it all drop to the side. And then cover the rest of it. Since it's all milk, also we like to have the milk show a little bit because when we do have them on the display, we have regular cakes, vanilla cakes, chocolate cakes. And so it's also kind of good the customer knows that they're getting a milk cake. So they like it here. Here at this, here with us, they actually, most of the time, they ask us they make the, to make sure we have it, put extra milk on it, and very, very milky. So simply, once the cake is coated, you can either ice it smooth, or I like to just kind of have the icing a little bit on there with some design. I like it, it makes it look a little more enticing and more of a dessert type, as opposed to a birthday cake, you would ice it smooth and then decorate it, write a happy birthday on it. And this one, just kind of ice it and let the milk run. The Dulce de Leche makes it the Cuatro Leches now. And so that has been very popular uh, this year with us here at the bakery. It took them a while to notice because they were always used to the Tres Leches. And um, now that they've tried it, they like it as a filling or they like us to cover it with it. And so then after that, you can just drizzle any kind of little topping on top. And that's your dessert.